it's me from coloringqueen.net and today I've got a Japanese coloring book and it's called Traveling in Scandinavia. <laughs> so let's dive in and have a look at it. We have got a colored card cover on the front which is nice and glossy so it won't show those grubby little fingerprints. And then we've got off-white paper which is a medium to heavy quality and the ink used is a sepia type color. Thumbnails at the beginning. And then double page printing. The binding is quite stiff on this coloring book, but it does fold down once you give it a good hard push. And so we've got our first picture with our cute little kids there and a gorgeous church I think that says welcome in Swedish I'm not sure now because the pages are double-sided illustrations you won't be able to use your markers that are alcohol based on this but the paper is really heavy it's like a a card stock and off white now this is a darker color ink that they've used on here and they're using a nice dull black on this page with a medium to heavy weight so it's super easy to see and look at all of these cute little images Denmark Sweden lovely little fox these are more sort of I don't know wallpaper style pages especially the fox one but I do like these sort of Scandinavian folk art type pictures We've got the midsummer here, this lovely image, lovely scenery. It seems funny though, a Japanese book on Scandinavia. And then we've got some different artwork completely with the textured little reindeer there. So completely different from the other style, but whatever, it's their book. I guess they can do whatever they like. We've got all these berries, so many animals. I don't think they're all native to Scandinavia though. <laughs> I could be wrong. Look at the sweet shop. Wouldn't you love to dive in there? We've got Jamaican coffee, Robert's coffee shop. Yes, I'd like some of those cakes and coffee, please, Robert. We've got different stamps. They're so very cute. Isn't this gorgeous with the lovely little scenery? And of course, we're making some crafty projects, some quilts organic cotton doing the right thing for the environment there and look at this gorgeous little christmas tree with the angels on it it's actually a lot cuter this book than i remember i've had it for a few years now and i haven't reviewed it it's my famous line isn't it and i couldn't remember that it was this cute some of these little simple flowers are really lovely little folk art look and lots of crystals and look at these little imps Aren't they gorgeous? This is all up. It's a pretty nice colouring book. If you like simple, cutesy sort of folk art images. We've got our gorgeous mermaid there. And all our lovely stained glass and churches. And then we've got some little postcards. Now there's a cutting line here, but it's not perforated. And you can cut those out, colour them in or not colour them in and send them off to your friend. In the background we have a lighter grey for those background images and some other books that they publish on the back there. So all up, a pretty cute little book from Japan of travelling in Scandinavia. That's it from me. Until next time, stay safe and happy colouring.